This is Polars in under 100 seconds. Polars is a blazingly fast data frame library. Polars is written in Rust and available for Python, R, and Node.js. Many people think Polars was given to us by aliens from the future, but in fact, it was designed by Richie Vink, an open source project that he created in 2020. Since Polars became mainstream recently in data engineering, its users are fighters and everyone claims it's better than everything else on the market. Most notably, Polars is known to be the pandas killer. Pandas, what used to be the most popular data frame tool out there for years, has now been supplanted by Polars. It's faster and better. Even though Polars was written in Rust, it's popular because of its Python bindings, so it can be pip installed easily. The Polar syntax is straightforward, just like Python, and easy to use, and very similar to Pandas, which makes it a popular choice. Surprisingly, its creators got something right, and its easy-to-use syntax for things like group by and aggregations is actually more straightforward than Pandas. You thought that was it? No, wait, there's more. You even get a SQL context with Polars that allows you to run straight SQL against your data frame. What else makes Polars tower over pandas like it's a little baby and smash it? Well, it's out of core processing. The stream API allows you to process your results without requiring all your data to be in memory at the same time, AKA as larger than memory data processing. But there is even another reason why Polars is the fastest because it uses all the available CPUs on your machine, dividing up the work, making it extremely fast and outpacing most tools out there. Polars is lazy, just like you. It doesn't run each query line by line, but instead processes the full query end to end. This lazy computation and execution allows for its out of memory data processing and optimizations to be applied, making it fast. This has been Polars in under two minutes. Like and subscribe, you filthy habit.